Hey guys, Lee here, Theme Park Ohana. On today's adventure, I'm here at the Walmart on 535 right outside of Walt Disney World to see what kind of unique merchandise they have. I do these videos once in a while uh, to see what merchandise has changed. So if you're coming for the summer, because now it's June and summer is getting ready to ramp up, let's check out what they got here for the summer of 2019. All right, let's go. things people don't realize is you can actually buy your uh, park tickets here at Walmart and as soon as you come in you're hit with Disney merch and it goes as far as the eye can see all the way down to the other side of the Walmart and there's plenty of options as far as t-shirts they also have universal stuff pool stuff let's start with the pool stuff today oh I love this Minnie Mouse and Daisy Duck towel these towels are all $13 look at that it's like a chalk art Mickey Mouse stitch or is that Angel? No, it's Stitch. Get a Harry Potter. Again, these are all $12.97. There's this Fab Five. And then just some regular, everyday Florida dolphins, touristy type towels. And also for $13, you can get the little towel like hoodies for the kids that you can wear when you're walking back to the room. So you can dry before you get back to the room and get everything wet. Oh, look at this one. It's Mickey and Minnie on the beach looking at a sunset. That is so awesome. And this is a lot of goggles and snorkels. It is like a whole aisle dedicated to just swimming goggles. That is impressive. But Walmart is a great place to get stuff for the pool if you didn't pack it or, you know, I mean, it's cheap enough that you could just buy it and throw it out when you're done. But look, even more goggles. Three packs for 15 bucks. Uh, how cute is that? <laughs> they have uh, rain ponchos that look like the minions from Despicable Me. And these are five dollars. They also have some like Despicable Me towels. This is more universal themed towels. These are twelve ninety seven as well. I guess that Harry Potter one found its way into the wrong aisle over there. Jen would be loving this one. It's a little cloak and a Gryffindor shirt, <laughs> and that is twelve ninety seven. Yeah, Jen would be really into these. And for $20, you have this little dress outfit. So you can do your little cosplay and go to Universal. But they have all kinds of different Harry Potter ones. And usually these are on the other end of the Walmart. I wonder if they're still going to be over there. Because usually I show that towards the end. What kinds of keychains. You can hold your annual pass in there. A little wallet around your neck. Oh, look. Goblets for cups. Ten dollars. <laughs> Look at this one. That's so cool. Very cool. I know nothing about Harry Potter. So I am seeing new stuff here that says 2019 that I didn't see last time I was here. That's cute. There's some cute shirts and they're thirteen dollars. They have the classic mom and dad matching shirts, brother, sister, grandma. Right here by the entrance is where you would walk in and actually purchase tickets if you wanted to. Nobody here right now, but I guess if I was interested, they would find somebody to come help me. Well, this shirt's cool for $12.97. It's glow in the dark. It kind of has like a Tron vibe to it. This one's kind of cool too. You got Mickey, Goofy, Donald, and Pluto. I like how the characters are actually in the numbers too. It's really cool. These 2019 shirts kind of look a lot like the shirts I showed you yesterday. The Disney Squad ones that they had at Port Orleans. They're actually not bad looking. And I really like this one too. I like the colors on it. It's different. But why is Donald so angry? Is it because he's like cramped in there? <laughs> That's awesome. I love shirts like this when Minnie's kissing Mickey or Mickey's kissing Minnie. It's so adorable. And this shirt always cracks me up. You got Minnie Mouse on the front, and then you got Minnie Butt on the back. And these are also $12.97. They have a lot of keychains. A lot of keychains. A couple that stand out to me is I really like this one here, and it's $2.60. They also have like a grumpy one. love with Mickey Mouse. This one's cool. Oh, look at that one. That was cute. These are really cute too. Look at that Mickey. 
but I love Mimi. And look how cute that Mini Mouse is. And of course, always our favorite, Stitch. Oh, these magnets are cute. A little dirty, I guess I've been handled a lot. But look at that Mini Mouse, the original cutie. And again, there they are kissing. Gotta love it. Looks like someone had a good time surrounding this Mickey and Minnie with movies. It's good to make it fun of them. Well, I kind of like this Mickey Mouse on the surfboard. That's a cool one. Oh, Katie. Tinkerbell. They have a bunch of pins for $4. And look, there's more Tinkerbell. And you got Anna. So Minnie Mouse, Mickey Mouse, the gang. Oh, look at this Donald one. Love that Donald face one. But uh, these aren't park pins. These are just Disney pins. Uh, they're $4. I guess you could probably trade them in the parks because they probably do say Disney on the back. I'm not going to rip any open and find out, but I think they do say Disney on the back. And I was like, look, oh, they got the keychains with the plastic, like the ones that hold the photo. And I was looking around for different ones, and it's almost 95% Star Wars, and they're $1.25. There is, I like this one, Jack Skellington. I think that's the only one that's not Star Wars. Is that Jack Skellington one. And they also have some kind of generic uh, lanyards. You could uh, save some money here if you're going to do some pin trade and you don't want to buy a lanyard in the park because these are only $4. Also a good way to save money at the park or the at your resort is these bubble blowers are only $13. I'm sure they're at least $20, $25 in the park. But again, they're kind of plain. It's just a Mickey Mouse, it looks like a Mickey Mouse clubhouse one. And then just a generic kind of Minnie Mouse one. And here's some dish towels, and there's that Mickey and Minnie staring off at the sunset again. I really like that one. I also like this Chef Mickey dish towel. And they got some like uh, pot holders, three piece kitchen sets, I guess they're called them. Dish towel, pot holder, and oven mitt. And that is $8. Look at this adorable salt and pepper shaker. That is so cute. And it's $12.97. So, not a lot really different here in the coffee cups. I'm sure there's going to be more. But it's pretty much the same ones I always see when I come here. Just the character spaces. Um, there's the Jack Skellington one. I don't know if I've seen that one before. And these are all $9. Uh, not much, that much of a savings from the parks because you can generally get coffee mugs for about $13.99. So I mean, you save a few dollars, but there's a lot more originality uh, for the mugs in the parks. These are cute. I guess I get, what are these, like espresso cups? But I uh, like to have a Snow White one. There's the Evil Queen, the Dwarves, and Snow White on it. And then there's a villain's one. Oh, Jen, look at that. That's cute. And these are $5. Hey, Jen, look. And for $4, you can get an evil villain's shot glass. Oh, look. And there's Stitch. Stitch is always, it's always hiding somewhere. That's cute, though. And these stovetop, uh, like, dish holders are really cute. Again, there's Mickey and Minnie staring at the sunset. I like these. Really cool. And they're $8. A must-have for this hot summer months is the fan with the spritz where you can spray some water on you. And that is $13 here. They got a bunch of refillable mugs. Again, kind of generic. Oh, there's that sunset again. I guess that's a, a common theme right now. These are cute with the little Mickey ears. And these are all $9. How adorable are these cereal bowls for $7? That is so cute. Got Mickey staring up at you. We're mini. And patches are all the craze right now. They have some here. Look at that one. That one's cute. And they're five dollars for each uh, pack or iron-on patches. And these are cute for five dollars. And look at this pickle me one ended up over here. But it's a Mickey and Minnie Mouse um, rain mira patches. Emily, Emily, mira and they're five dollars. These are interesting. They're like sleeveless hoodies, but I like the art on them. They're also twelve ninety-seven. But I like that Mickey face right there, it's cute. There's also a Minnie Mouse one. Rock the bow. And of course, as always, stitches are hanging around. And for $16, I have these really cute Minnie Mouse dresses. I don't know if these are like uh, pool dresses you wear over your bathing suit. There's not a lot to them. But they're, they're nice, 16 bucks. I really like the Mickey and Minnie faces on these shirts too. These are $12.97. This might be the best deal going in this place. For $9, they have these sling purses. And they have some great designs, like this I Heart Mickey and this princess one. So, and they're only $9. How, how is it so cheap? That is awesome. These are a great deal. Uh, Jen's going to be excited. They have new fanny packs. And if you know Jen, you know she's a fan of the fanny pack. I, however, am not. But the art is cute. I don't like that it's white, though. It'll get dirty real easy. <clears throat> but there is a black one with just Mickey. 
They also have tote bags here for $15, good for the pool, and uh, other little sling backpacks for $7. Nothing crazy with the artwork, just Mickey faces or the buttons on his pants. And a couple more on this side. So I'm going to show you some of the designs. And these tote bags on this side are only $7. And look, here's more of those $8 sling purses. It's a great deal. They also have like $8 wrist, the little wristlet purses. If you're not carrying much to the park, that'll work for you. And here's some more $5 um, ponchos. I really like this. I'm telling you, I like that design. And there's a couple more designs I got. And there's a design I haven't seen before. Hello, is it me you're looking for? I can see it in your eyes. I can see it in your smile. Some interesting colors here on this Mickey shirt. I like this one. Oh, they're so cute. And back past the hello one. Bows rule the world. And Mickey, where has your face gone? So I'm trying to just stick to stuff I didn't see last time I was here, so I am going to post here the uh, link to the video from the last time I was here, so if you want to keep watching and keep shopping, because there's a lot of the stuff that was in the last video that's still here now. Well, that's a cute mini shirt. Very su subtle. I like the colors. And this one's really, really cute. It's a Di it's Disney princess. I belong in a castle. Ain't that the truth? Some of these crack me up like, oh, so fabulous. But why is it covering her face? <laughs> this one's really cute. Mickey, Minnie, Donald, Goofy, and me. And this is $12.97. Oh, Mickey, no need to be so bashful. This is cute. They have, for $9, they have some youth flip-flops here. And I like the design, so I'm gonna get this Mickey one. It's cute. Oh, it's not focusing. There we go. So now we're hitting the youth section, and this is kind of cute. It's uh, Minnie Mouse, 100% real unicorn dreams. It looks, she's kind of like doing a unicorn cosplay. That's adorable. How much are these? I just don't really have a price. And these are also $12.97. I'm just going to show you some of the designs. They're all $12.97. So you guys kind of look at all the different youth designs here for girls. I think my favorite is that cosplay one though. What do you guys think? Did you like that cosplay one? Now these are an interesting cut of shirt. It almost looks like the bottom of a bib. And it's the the fabric is like the the sweat away fabric. And these are $12.97 too. Oh look. Zoom zooms. Interesting. Fun times at an amusement park, but that amusement park doesn't look like Disney World. Wonder where they're at. Now this shirt's different. This one's only $10.97. It's kind of like an animated or animators print of the princesses. It's kind of cute. Here's kind of another one. It just says Royals and it has Ariel Bell and Rapunzel. A couple other shirts here. And these are $10.97. And here is a youth version of that, what I what I believe to be a pool dress. And it's $12.47. Does it tell you on the tag what it is? No, it really doesn't. Put some comments below. What, what would you call this? Because I have no idea. Ah, the classic headless shirts where you become the character for $9.47. So not only is Donald angry, for some reason Pluto's not too happy either. And these are $9.47. And I have a bunch of youth uh, baseball caps here. A couple of different designs and these are only $10.97. And here are some adult ones. And one looks very familiar. That one. And these are $12.97. So you can tell Disney knows what they're doing because it starts with women's stuff and family stuff, goes to more women's stuff, children's stuff, and then finally, the, at the end, because I'm getting near the end, is the men's apparel. They're targeting the women, the shoppers, the ones who like to spend, aka Jen. So here's more youth hats. There's like cars on it. It's kind of a mess. Um, and these are $9.97 on this side. And here's another end cap that has men's. And these are well, men's and women's, I guess, adults for $12.97. They also have adult flip-flops right here too, and these flip-flops are $10. Some of the designs are pretty cool, like I like this one. It's got a Polynesian vibe to it. They also have a lot of onesies. Oh, the Minnie Mouse onesies. So this is, uh, I guess, a toddler baby type section. 
Be your selfie. That's a great quote. This, oh, this, the artwork on these is way better. Look at Mickey Mouse wearing the prop mustache. Wearing a backwards cap. Ah, the artwork on these are original. Like, I've never seen these. These are awesome. Look. Silly is my thing. This is awesome. Really, really good stuff. It's all really heavily themed towards the original characters, but every once in a while you'll find a shirt like... There's a Toy Story one. And here's some Star Wars ones. Troublemaker and Little Trooper. Here's another Toy Story one. This one's cute. I like that one. I found a shirt for Jeremy. Always grumpy. Actually, probably more for Ryan. Oh, they have a good, like, grumpy selection here. Approach with caution. I'm grumpy. Don't make it worse. I don't know if I really like that shirt, but I do like this shirt. Best day ever. And look at, like, the... Uh, Look how happy Mickey is. I love it. Oh, I spotted some more Toy Story. We got a Toy Story beach towel, $12.97. They actually do have, in the youth sizes, they do have a lot of Star Wars shirts. You got like BB-8, Darth Vader, The Last Jedi shirt, Rogue One shirt, Co-Pilot, there's oh, <coughs> Chewbacca. So not bad Star Wars selection. They actually have another section of towels here as well, and there's a lot of Star Wars towels. And right past all the Disney stuff, you have your generic Orlando, Florida, touristy type merch. And this is, there's a lot of grumpy shirts in the men's section. This is great. Grumpy since 1937. Same face, different day. And these are $12.97. And also in the men's section, they got a decent selection of Star Wars. Not much in the way of Marvel. But there are some Star Wars shirts here. And then you got, interesting, universe, uh, it's not a universal shirt, it's just an Avengers shirt. It just says, Florida. Weird. Very weird. This one too, this Captain America one. Florida. <laughs> I guess it's the only place in the world you can get these shirts. These shirts. They're very unique. Hard to get. Because you gotta be in Florida. Wow, I really like this shirt. That is awesome. I would definitely rock this shirt. This one warms my heart. Donald has a smile on his face. Oh, that just made my day. And this one's really cool. It's years of imagination, Mickey Mouse. And it has all different Mickey Mouses like Steamboat Willie, the original one. And what's also really cool is there's like a patch already ironed on or sewed on. That is really cool. And I love these shirts here because you know, Mickey Mouse is out of this world. So cute. Shocker, I found another grumpy shirt. It says, I am smiling. And I'm sure all of you have seen these plenty of times in the parks. I don't do matching shirts. This is a pretty cool shirt. It's different, but I'm laughing at the one next to it. Genius in disguise. Yeah, you keep telling yourself that goof. And look what I found hidden behind it. Another grumpy shirt. What is going on here, Mickey? It's a lot of sash you got going on. It's also good to note right here behind the clothing section is a dressing room. So if you want to try some stuff on, not seeing a lot of hoodies today, but I guess because it is the summer, they probably don't have a lot of hoodies for sale. It's more like a fall or winter thing. Like this might be the only thing even close to a hoodie here and it's a woman's and it's just like a light, it's just a little heavier than a t-shirt material. Oh, this is new for $9. You can get a Steamboat Willie plush. Although, I don't know, it's a little off. A lot of the plushes here at the Walmart are just a little bit off. Even the Sorcerer Mickey one. And they have a lot of plushes ranging from $23 for the biggest all the way down to $9 for the smallest. And you can get just a plain poncho here for $3. Look how cute this little Tigger baby toy is for $6. But again, these some of these are off. Like Daisy looks just doesn't look right. And this is supposed to be from 101 Dalmatians. I don't know. And if you just want some really cheap flip-flops, they got a bunch of them here for $3.44. What a random price. They have loads and loads of sunglasses for just $11. And they have a giant selection of sunscreen. And it looks like seven bucks. Gets you to spray on the stick. Look, they even have photo ops here. That is great. I'm also loving all this promotional stuff for Toy Story 4. You got Woody there. But here you 
you got Buzz. There's uh, it's all Buzz. And then some of the new characters. And Bo Peep. So that is going to do it for today's shopping trip here at the Walmart. A lot of new stuff. Like I said, I will link in my last visit because I, there's a lot of stuff I didn't show that is in that other video. So if you want to keep watching, it'll be right here at the end of the video. You can just click on it and go to it. Also have it like tagged up in the corner. Um, so if you enjoyed the video, hit that subscribe button. Give us a like. Make sure you hit that little notification bell so you know when the next video is coming. But now we're on to the next adventure. Bye, guys.